When President Richard Nixon faced the smoking gun tape, then resignation, this ship, a wooden yacht called Sequoia, was a retreat. It is literally the floating White House. Treaty talks with Brezhnev, birthday bashes for JFK. Sequoia's hosted it all. Now she's 94 years old, in desperate need of repair. We have to replace the hull. Todd French of French and Webb Ship Restoration is leading the work, expected to take years. This is just on a scale of its own. To walk on that boat, you get goosebumps. Emotions felt by the 100 plus people who watched the yacht, feet from her weathered timbers, come ashore Monday. The woodworking yeah, the is woodwork. amazing. Part of it is the history for sure, and, and just the, the nature of the vessel itself. And for one man, that history is already part of his life. A guest of Richard Nixon's, right? Robert Crawford went out on Sequoia with wounded soldiers during the Vietnam War. He has a certificate from the ride and calls the boat an escape from a difficult time in American history. But going on that boat was kind of a release from all that. I want to see that stern because I was sitting there for just about all the trip. The public will get plenty of glimpses of Sequoia too. When the ship moves to this parking lot, a building will be wrapped around her. The plan calls for an observation deck where anyone can watch the restoration in a community proud to host this project. Shows that coming to where it gets it done right. And no part of this restoration is going to be short. It's going to take 10 months just to figure out how the boat needs to be repaired, then 30 months or so just to do those repairs. In Belfast, Maine, Dustin Lukowski, NECN.